What does a legend look like? Well, it certainly has form. Ford GT has a form that stretches back almost 40 years. Inspired by the Ford GT40 racing legend, the new GT is a modern interpretation of the Ford supercar that shocked the world at the 24 Hours of Le Mans in 1966. Taking cues from the original, Ford designers conceived curves, scoops, and wheel wells that wrap tightly around underlying mechanicals capable of propelling Ford GT with a blistering 500 horsepower. The current machine is over a foot and a half longer and stands nearly four inches taller than the original. Ford designers achieved the organic and geometric concept by creating smooth, natural intersecting surfaces accented by simple, subtle lines. The long front overhang features a sweeping cowl and front fenders that curve around 18-inch wheels. Prominent on the leading edge of the rear quarter panels are functional cooling scoops that channel fresh air to the mid-mounted engine. The rear wheel wells filled with 19-inch wheels define the rear of the car while the accent line from the front cowl meets with and finishes the machine's profile at the integrated ducktail spoiler. Peer in through the backlit window and find Ford GT's powerful engine sitting squarely on an aluminum space frame specifically designed for the generation of heavy horsepower. The power plant is an all-American V8 from Ford's modular engine family. The 5.4-liter supercharged engine features all aluminum components engineered to produce 500 horsepower and 500 foot-pounds of torque. In the tradition of championship racers of the 1960s, the doors cut into the roof. The GT interior is devoid of frivolous luxury, but attention to ergonomics and classic detail is readily apparent. Like the original, the leather-trimmed custom bucket front seats feature ventilated fabric and a milled aluminum center console runs the entire length of the passenger compartment. The color theme is black and silver. Driving instruments along the dashboard are analog and strategically positioned, enabling the driver to keep his eyes on the road. While you won't see any GTs on the road until 2004, the fact that Ford decided to bring this legendary racing machine to production is a signal to the past with a confident nod towards the future.